Right, so it turns out there are sites online where you can just pull up a random image from Imgur, which, if you don't know, is just like an image hosting platform, so anyone can just upload whatever. So let's, as you can see, we've got a um, very funny, unique meme here, I guess. This is the kind of memes they had back in, like, 2012. Like, you remember? Remember seeing this kind of stuff? Maybe I'm just, like, showing my age here, but I remember when this was just, like, the go-to meme. You got, um, some guy just, like, going to town on a Donald Duck. Donald Duck looks like he's terrifying here. Look at his face. Like, his whole body's got the texture of, like, a sock. Which wouldn't be too bad if it was, like, a sock puppet, but it's, like, very much not. Why is Donald Duck holding, like, a bow staff, too? I guess to protect himself from, like, people like this just coming to wail on him. We got, um... If you know what this is, you know what this is. I'll just leave it at that. We got someone holding a cat, which, um... This cat's got, like, a funny expression on his face, but I think it's kind of fitting, given where it's being grabbed in this picture. Like, imagine being held up like this. You'd look like that, too. You'd have that same exact pose. We've got a thing of toothpaste, which someone has very carefully printed out a label for that reads toothpaste, despite the fact that the container has the word toothpaste clearly written on it. So, I don't know what's going on here. Like, the thing that's not labeled is the mouthwash it comes with, but that's not the right label. Maybe they're... Like, the only way this would make sense is if the bottle with the label has mouthwash in it, and the little thing there has toothpaste. Or, no, wait, it's not even how it works. The container on the right is, like, some super futuristic hybrid substance that's both toothpaste and mouthwash. And I just got some random bottle. Are they gonna, like, transfer it over? Like, even if they do, even if you, I don't know, you don't like that packaging, you want to put it in a different container. I don't know where I was going with that. Yeah. Look at this meme. This is, isn't this like the crustiest meme you've ever seen? Maybe not even like terms of image quality, but in terms of like content. This is a picture from like 2009. This isn't even like the dominant form of the meme that was active at the time. This is like someone found a picture and like tried to make a version. Like this is some extinct micro species off branch of the main meme that got lost to time. Yeah, this happened to a buddy of mine, actually. Like, this big, giant dog came up to him. Yeah. Brocraft sing-along. I'm guessing this is, like, a Minecraft, someone's pet project. Them and a, some friends were doing it. I hope they had a good time. Like, if you were there for the Brocraft sing-along, put it down in the comments. I like how a lot of these old memes, too, that we're pulling up don't make any sense. This meme only works in a very certain context, and we don't have that context. It's just, like, a reaction image, I guess? But, like, it's not funny. Like, you- there's no punchline here. It's just, you suck in a picture of, like, the guy from Futurama. I- I don't know. There's a tractor afoot. Don't put in too much effort there. Write us two paragraphs about why pandas are important for the ecosystem, and we will credit you with pro. What's pro? We've got an image here. I tried blowing it up. It is so low quality, though. It's 100 by 75, so... I don't know what you could possibly gain from an image like this. We've got another very crusty meme about someone who's very passionate about martial arts. It's good that they know, like, the difference and are standing up for them, but it's still, like, a very odd reaction to have your response be a rage comic. Also, Jakey Chan. That's pretty cool. Okay, here's a gif of some guy trying to put his baggage away in an airport. Oh, look, it's funny because he was slamming some guy's head. But even, like, even if it got shut, wouldn't he, like, slam his thumbs in the door based on how he's holding it? This makes no sense. How do you get a guy to propose? Not make him propose, just how to bring it up and plant that seed in his mind. And some guy responded, Inception. 
I've never seen Inception, but I've heard a lot of people talking about it. I don't remember anyone saying that it had anything to do with, like, marriage proposals. Like, I think a rom-com would be better suited for that kind of purpose. O okay. I wonder what, like, the age range of pictures distributed to Imgur is. Because, like, this... This, I'm pretty sure this is supposed to be like someone's brand new iPhone 5, like, most of these pictures have got to be like, old. This is me when... A lot of these pictures go hard, I gotta say, like, this slaps, dude, look at that. I wonder how, what the context for this photo being made was. This, someone on Tumblr made this, you can tell. I gotta say, the editing is pretty well done, though. Like, the way that the word feels, like, disperses into multiple smaller copies, but only with, like, certain strikes. There's a lot of attention to detail here. Okay, I'm gonna let you read this. I'm gonna censor it. Because there's just, I wanna show you, there's a lot of crazy stuff I'm getting right now. Here's someone's sick ride. Here's a nice uh, shot for all the freaks out there. You know what I'm talking about. I'm guessing this is also from where I think it is. And so, as such, maybe we'll end it here. I recorded this in hindsight as I'm recording this. I realized I probably did some stuff wrong with regards to like how I chose to record it. So I'm probably gonna do more of these in the future and probably gonna be like a bit better quality in terms of the image, like how I display them. But still gotta figure some stuff out. For now, this is gonna be what it looks like, this first one. You know, the first video is always gonna be rough, but yeah, thanks for watching. This is probably gonna be really short, but yeah.